For this question, we are going to find y-intercepts for 4x squared plus 25y squared is equal to 1. And whenever we are trying to find y-intercepts, we are going to let x equals to 0, and then we will solve for y. Once again, whenever we are trying to find y-intercepts, we need to let x equal to 0, and then we'll go ahead and solve for the y. Let's plug in 0 into this x. And then we have 0 squared, which is still going to be 0. 0 times 4, still 0. So this term will be 0. And then we will have plus 25y squared is equal to 1. And as you can see, this is just pretty much saying 25y squared is equal to 1. So how can we solve this? This is 25 times y squared. Let's divide both sides by 25 first. So that the 25 and 25 right here will cancel out. And then we are looking at the equation as y squared is equal to 1 over 25. And then this is y to the second power. To get rid of the second power, we are going to take the square root on both sides. So that the second power and the square root will cancel. But then don't forget to put a plus minus on the right hand side with the number. At the end, we will have y is equal to plus minus and then we do square root of 1, which is going to be 1, and then square root of 25 on the bottom is just going to be 5. So we have y is equal to plus minus 1 over 5. But then for the y-intercept, remember, it is a point, and then here we have two values for the y. So when we know x is equal to 0, we will get the first y-intercept at 1 over 5. We also have another one when x is 0, y could also be negative, right, the negative 1 over 5. So these two points are the y-intercepts that we have, and that's it.